Hey everyone, welcome back to the Vakas Tech. So guys, in this video, I will show you how to fix iPhone Safari browser not working after update iOS 18. Lot of iPhone users facing this kind of issue. Even I am also facing that kind of issue on my iPhone 12 that recently update on iOS 18. So in this video, I will show you how you can fix that. There are some methods to solve that issue. So without wasting any time, let's start the video. First of all, make sure you are connected with strong Wi-Fi or cellular data when you try to use your Safari browser, okay? If you are not connected with strong Wi-Fi or cellular data, then your Safari browser not working. So make sure your internet connection working well. If that method not working, then move to the next solution. The next solution is forced to restart your iPhone. Press volume up button, then press volume down button and press the power button until you see the Apple logo appears on your iPhone screen and your iPhone is forced to restart. Okay, if that method is also not working and you're still facing the issue, then move to the next solution. The next solution is open iPhone settings. Okay, in settings section, you need to scroll down below and search here safari browser okay you can see a person screen there is no safari browser showing you right now in iphone okay so tap on apps after tapping the apps you need to scroll down below okay you can see a person screen find here safari browser just tap on that Okay, you can see a person screen showing here all options showing here. Make sure your iPhone Safari browser selected on default browsing app like this. And after that, you need to scroll down below and turn on all settings that are showing right now in my iPhone. Okay, after that, you can see a person screen here are showing extensions and download. And in the bottom, you can see a person screen showing here all options you need to scroll down below and you can see a person screen here option showing here clear history and website data just select that and after that you need to clear all your iphone safari browser data after that your safari browser working well so there are some method to solve that issue after watching this video i hope you will all know how you can fix that hope this video is helpful for you if the video is helpful for you don't forget to share and subscribe my youtube channel and press the bell icon for upcoming videos notifications thanks for watching